So we're in the Solomon Islands to study a submarine volcano called Kavachi, and it's dangerous. You see it? Oh, a little bit, yeah. Absolutely, yeah. we were scared. Kavachi is usually erupting, it's spewing like hot lava and ash. And when we went out, it was not erupting. Three, two, go. One. Off it goes. So we're dropping this camera down uh, primarily to take a closer look at the volcano. The water's hot, it's acidic, it's hostile enough. To see interesting biology uh, is just a bonus. Right here. Beauty. Let me go get the data before I start getting too excited, too carried away. Here comes the skite. Oh, hey! Beauty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wonder if that's his little cave home thingy there, you know? Man, it has the most. Oh, that's so, so cool. cool. Like, like a, what was that? Hey. Something there. A shadow of something. There's something off. Nice. The idea of there being large animals like sharks hanging out and living inside the caldera of this volcano conflicts with what we know about Kavachi, which is that it erupts. But when it's erupting, there's no way anything could live in there. And so to see large animals like this that are living and potentially, you know, they could die at any moment. It brings up lots of questions. Do they leave? Do they have some sort of sign that it's about to erupt? You know, do they blow up sky high in little bits? <laughs> the fact that we saw animals in the plume like that, that opens up all kinds of interesting questions. That's the best project, is to go out with one question and come back with many. And that's exactly what happened here.